Yes. Yes, we're back at this lovely game again. Yes. Hello and welcome back, my little knights. It's one of Kishiro, and I'm back with some more Dragon Quest XI. Such a fun game. Uh, anyway, just give me a second. I'm going to change my. Um... Yeah, good change to HDMI 1 so I can properly see the game. Uh, there we go, and I'm going to say as well, off screen, I um, did do something, but I'll explain it when we're actually in the game. Um, yeah, anyway, here's what happened so far. With Hendrick and a horde of Heliodorian soldiers hot on their heels, Kikoro and Eric have hurtled themselves through the door of departure and into the great unknown. Whilst soaking in the steam baths of Hoto, uh, they, they meet a little lost girl called Connie. And Anne set out to help her find her, her father. While searching, they decided to help a girl called Veronica, who's lost her sister somewhere. Veronica and her twin sister, Serena, explained um, that they were sent to find Kikoro, as it's their sworn duty to safeguard the heir to the Luminary of Legend. The one who defeated the, the Dark One and saved the world so long ago. Having joined forces, they agreed that the best way forward is to make their way to Yggdrasil. Every time I see that, I'm like, y -y 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 Yeah, I can never can read yeah, Yggdrasil right, because I always go, ye Because <laughs> like, it's spelled for a fucking Y. Anyway, as the Luminary's fate is inexorably intertwined with that of the World Tree, perhaps they're... they're, they're no, there. Perhaps there they will find a way. A, they will find out. Well, I can't read. Don't bully me. But yeah, perhaps there. Oh, fuck's sake! I wish this was deliberate. Perhaps there they will f find out why it is that 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 he has been born again after all these years. Fucking reading hard. <laughs> the friends find out from Noah. Famed knower of things, that he saw a branch of in Golopolis that glimmered with all the colours of the rainbow, reasoning that this might well be a, a, a bout of the world tree itself. No idea what that fucking word says. Anyway, um, and therefore useful to them in their quest. They set out to track it down. I had to have a drink. So good. I mean, and just um, you know what I mean by I had to do something is um, I off screen realized last time I played this game that I didn't have all the DLCs unlocked, and I was really annoyed because this is the premium at eh, sixty nine. <laughs> Sorry, my my smooth brain was like hat. My HP's at sixty nine. Nice. No, anyway, uh, with that, I got some new equipment, like down here, uh, Wolfware, which is a special item for Eric. Yeah, all these stuff that I I could have had, but I didn't have on me, which is annoying. Even these ones, the elevating vest and the the the, 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 the vest. <laughs> I I completely forgot about those items, and they are very useful because they do boost stats. And also, I like this a lot better. I like that Eric looks like Lupin more. Yeah, fucking Arsène Lupin. And I didn't even know, like, how. I, every time I read that, when I've read that before, I knew it. I thought it said Lupin. It's like, no. There's like a error in, like, translation. It's Lupin. Lupin! It's weird. And yeah, and then this is one of the old Dragon Quest um, main characters. Anyway, let's just, um, yeah, look at that. HP up and charm up, but loss of defense. So, no, I'm just going to give myself this one, the Elevating Vest, which boosts my um, defensive... Uh, this lowers my defense, but increases EXP gain, which is quite useful. And then, yeah, let's just do that, because Veronica looks better like that. That's not like <laughs> Veronica's an annoying tweet. That's not good. Um... Let's see what I've, I've got to add to him. 
But um Yeah, I need to see what, what to give Serena and um Veronica as I have like not given them anything. Yeah, this gives um Serena that she's a much better um wizard or magician or whatever the fuck than her sister. And, she, and plus like she's not better than that. She's not that good as like a physical fighter. That's why I'm not equipping that stuff to her. Anyway, um well, yeah, since she's like the weakest, and everything else I'm gonna give her is weaker, I might as well give her the the money vest. Increases money. Then Veronica. Yeah, that's what it would give for offense. This is more defense. This is more magical. All right then. Uh, well, anyway, I'll give Veronica the baby ball costume at the bottom, and hairpin. Um. Actually, yeah. That would be bad, in all honesty. And then for um. Serena, I'll give her the feathered cap. Well, it works out better. And anyway, now we're on to go to Golopolis. But also, we will fight more villains along the way. Oh, I just remember something important. We have a long journey ahead of us, uh, don't we, Kikuro? Well, I happen to know this handy little spell that makes it a lot easier. Just give me a minute. Yes! There we go. <laughs> Yeah, imagine getting to a spell like without I fucking said it. <laughs> nah, it's so dumb and it kills to do that. Quick drink break break. Anyway, I have learnt the, the spell Zoom. You can use this spell that I just taught you to travel back to anywhere you've been before, quick as a flash. If you want to come back to Hoto, for example, just cast the spell Zoom. Think of Hoto and you'll be there, just like that. Right now, Alright, right, now that you've got this little beauty in your bag of tricks, let's go find the Yggdrasil branch, shall we? Galopolis is southwest of here. Come on! Yeah, that I can't take it seriously because of the pig outfit, but it works. It works for me. It makes me feel better. Yeah, da, 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 da. Back to the fray! Oh yeah, as well. Um, yeah, I completely forgot that, like, character-wise, like, me and Eric are weaker out of the bunch. Anyway, need to go run and, um, find... Well, I, I know exactly where it is. But, um, yeah, we just need to get there. And, um, still the amazing thing is after the hours, the two streams I've done this beforehand of this game, yeah, now we've gotten to the point of where, like, the, um... The free DLC stuff has stopped. What well, free DLC? No, the just, uh, fucking demo. That's the word. I, I couldn't think of the fucking word. <laughs> Why couldn't they think of the fucking word? But anyway, now this is where like the demo ends essentially, and then you're like forced to like uh, buy the game. But it's like it gives you so much content, and it tells you that the game you're in for a long ride when you buy the game, you which is so fun. Oh, right, yeah, I need to set that up. And you know the things you can't change that. There we go. Tactics. Uh, follow orders. Follow orders. Makes Our it easier. Makes it a lot easier for us. There you go. Then spell. Yeah, only uses... Yeah. It's a really just better thing to fire. Just whack him. Anyway, yes, little piggy. Yeah, little piggy use crack. Yes, good little piggy. Veronica wins again. Oh, I still love just having her as a little piggy. Just like, yeah, dumbass. It just fits more for this play type, don't you think? Just makes it look a bit more silly. But nevertheless. We are off to continue the adventure to go look 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 this. Rubber rabbit. I love the design. Anyway. Yep. Eric, you sleeper hit. Sleeper hit. Good job. Great sword guard. Barrier. Then, um. 
him of fire. And the reason why I did all that is just because I wanted to see Persecutor. How do you like this? Fuck. <laughs> That's a lot of damage. But yeah, like Persecutor does a lot more damage if the enemy is either poisoned or if they've or they've gone to sleep, man. Yay! <laughs> yeah, he's coming to annoy. <laughs> yeah, but like I was saying, there's a lot more damage when um yeah, when either poisoned or sleeping, because it says it in the stats, so that's why the poison moth is a lot, a lot better as well. Oh, uh, no. No, it's paralysis. Never mind. Uh, I can... No, there it is. Eric. Let's look at his knife stats. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, is sleeping or confused? Alright. And since I've got sleeper here, uh, I can just do that one more combo and then just deal fuck load of damage. Yeah, and I think we should work towards that next, this dual wield. Because then, like, Eric could do a lot more damage. Anyway, tick, uh, tick tock, tick tock. Oh dear, oh dear, I shall be too late, I fear. Yeah, and then this is, like, not DLCs. This is, like, main game stuff. You wouldn't get this in the demo, but demo gives so much to begin with. If someone doesn't step in to save the day, Tickington's time is well truly up. Tick tock, the clock won't stop. It really is five minutes to midnight. Really? If only there was someone who could help come to our aid. Hold on a tick. You've clocked me, am I right? Can it be true? Can you really see me? Yes, I can. Well, it's about time. I was beginning to think I was totally invisible. This can only mean one thing. You're a hero, aren't you? Oh, tickety-tickety-boo, you're finally here. And not a moment too soon. I hate that I said tickety-boo. I really do. <laughs> I mean, it's a pleasure to meet you, Mr. Hero. My name is Ickle. I'm a Tockle from over Tuckington, uh, Tickington, Tickington Way, and we need your help. We're having a terrible time at the moment. Can I ask you to be the hero of our hour? Yes. Phew, thank you, Mr. Hero. I knew it. I knew it would take you more than a moment to agree. Uh, Kikoro, who are you talking- are you talking to yourself right now? Has the sun gone to the end or something? Well, the clock is ticking. Come on, it's time to, um, to show you and your friends the way to Tickington. Follow me. Oh, but wait, before we head off, you might want to save your progress. Because, yeah, just fuck it. Might as well just, yeah. There you go. There we go, all done. Now let's make our way to Tickington, shall we? We'll be there in no time flat. Oh, I feel flat. I feel real fucking flat. Oh. I was gonna make a comment, but I just couldn't think of an anime character. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> uh, fucking that anime boar skin. Uh, I didn't know that. That's funny. Oh no, what just happened? Things went all wavy, and then all of a sudden we're in this weird village. Oh look, he's so adorable. But who is he? TikTok, looks like you got clocked by me. You clocked me too. You must be the Mr. Hero here's friends. Welcome to Tickington, a place that's a little bit out of the ordinary. Normally, only certain people can see us tockles types, but the second, the second even ordinary, yeah, but the second even ordinary folks set in here in our home, they can see us too. Uh, I think we need to, we need a little background here. Like, who are you? Why are we here? What, what the hell? Yeah, where are we? What, why the heck are we here? You know, the little stuff. How about you start from the beginning? Beginning? Yes, yes, of course, the beginning. Tickety boo, uh, allow me to explain. We are Tuckles. We live in this village of Tickington. The music's overtaken me. Yeah, fuck this dialogue boring shit. Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> anyway. Yay! Alright. Nah, 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 nah. Oh, that's cool. Just a little map thing that shows up to tell us where we're going. Let's go to the bar, but let's get wasted. We have five ravages of beverages, including many of uh, human favorites, so. Alright. Yeah, no, fuck that. No, you confused me, I'm out. Oh, and the 8 bit crushed sound. Nice. 
Anyway, um, let's go in here. The inn. Let's go to the bank. <laughs> yeah, we can't deposit anything. Yeah, we only got a couple hundred. A couple hundred gold. There's someone we can talk to. Let's talk to this random toggle. You know what I mean? Well, good to take uh, it You must have wasted time, though. The mayor wants to speak to you. You can probably find him upstairs in the echo chamber. Yeah. The echo chamber. Tick lock. It's fucking. Tick tock. Look who I've got. It's the luminary. No, remember too soon. Oh, marvelous timing. Welcome to Tickington. My name is Stickle, and I am the mayor of this fine place beyond space and time. Now the clock is ticking, so I'll be brief. My people have a, a sacred mission, and that's why we have sought you out. Take a look at the tomes and sit at the altars around us. They sit on the tomes around us. Um, in these sacred volumes are inscriptions and uh, that describe the tales of hallowed heroes from other worlds and other ages. Since time immemorial, the duty of the people have been guarded these books. The duty of my people has been guarding these books, and to ensure that the great deeds of the past live on the present. That's why we created this place where we we are now. No, 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 no the echo chamber. Echo Beach, far away in time. <laughs> Yeah, my smooth brain went there. A sacred place where the adventurer logs of all how I'm not doing voice anymore. Of, of old can be found in ravages of time. Also we thought, but this holy a haven has been sullied by an unknown miscreant who took it upon themselves to tear whole pages from our beloved books and liberally daub other others with ink. I'm afraid I have no idea who committed this. Uh, heinous crime. I presume that's heinous. I can't. I can't read. <laughs> but what do I? What do I know? Oh, uh, is that why? But what I do know is that, as things stand, the heroic happenings of the past risk being lost forever. History itself hangs in the balance, which is where you come in as the hero of, of your own age. I must ask you. No, 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 no. Get the volumes. Yeah, this is just side mission stuff. Like, yeah. Not really important for the story. It's like if you find a, a book, just send it back. Uh, you, know, you managed to find a password the other just the other day. Got my little TikTok tyke share. Ah, fucking all the, the fucking TikTok fucking puns are gonna get real annoying and tedious. I only say it once. Uh. Tells you the password. Ah, oh, just that's annoying. I'll go visit Gonohachalam via the Altar of Origins. Alright. We. Oh, yeah, there it is. The, the little book that's glowing farts. The words Altar of Origins are etched in stone. And enter there. Yes. We're back in time. Oh, yeah. Look at this shit. Oh, yeah, let's just do this. Cutting edge on that. Attack. Yeah, just just attack. Everything attack it. There you go. Just kill it immediately. Yeah. This is so annoying. Uh, fuck this, we're out. <laughs> we're not doing this. Nope, nope. I'd rather go to Galopolis than do this shit. I'm out. Deuces. Yeah, we will do this at a later date. Or if people want to see it. <laughs> there's, the, there's the truth of this man. We're not doing the, the talkings and stuff. Tick tock, I'm getting the fuck out of here. Tick tock, you can suck my cock. There he goes, I found something. I found something to do. Tick tock, suck my cock. Welcome back, Luminary. I heard you took a moment to listen to the mayor's request. Thank you and good luck. 
I am equals hunkle. I was about to say husband. Why the fuck was I supposed to say husband? I <laughs> uh, couldn't care. Bye bye. Okay, I couldn't care. Bye bye. Oh god. Oh, none shall pass without a, a, um, a pass. Yes, show me my pass. <coughs> mm, very well. Everything seems to be over. Free you go. Yay! Yay! A lot better than the, the Tickington plates. I couldn't care about them. The Galopolis region! Yay! I even love that effect as well. Since this is a hot desert, you can see the uh, heat waves. So, I love it so much. Nope. Oh, I forgot what the, the button was. Yeah! Press every other button. Skeleton soldiers. Here we go. Spells. Sizz. Nope. Can't do that. Just do basic attack on one of them. I'm, I can also use Sizz. Nice. Here we go. Oh shit. Him afar. Yeah, we might beat that. Yeah, attack Serena, you cheeky bastard. Yeah, we defeated them. Who else wants some? <laughs> nice. Anyway, two into Golopolis. Now I should just kill these little these little troll bastards. Yeah. Nah, nah. no. Attack the brownie. Attack those brownie bastards. Oh, that actually sounded bad, but no. That's what the mob's called. It's called a, it's called a brownie. You're, you're what those stoners have. Ah. Uh, spells crack. Yeah, brownie take crack. Yeah, just do basic attack. It was enough. And don't come back. Just shut the fuck up, Veronica. Not doing anything. Oh, nothing significant. There we go. That was the button I wanted. Yay! I keep forgetting the buttons for some fucking reason. <laughs> and I love just horses, horse people. All said does horse people. Here we go. Now into Galopolis, this nice Egyptian esque city. It was based in the desert. Ooh. Oh, look at that, it's a circus. And what looks to be like the uh, the throne room. Festival going on, I wonder. Hmm. Little piggy. Yes, Little piggy. Of piggy. Pig. 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 This is the kingdom of the desert knights, isn't it? And of the racetrack where they love to compete. Oh. I think we've arrived in town just in time for the horse racing festival. Pig. 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 Well, you go play with ponies if you like. I'm off to look for the Yggdrasil branch. That's why we're here, in case you've forgotten. Oh, let Mr. Moody No Fun go off on his own if he wants. There's nothing to stop us having a little look around while we're here. Pig, 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 and I also do love these, um, I love the knights, I do, because all, like, all their design is based off, based off of, like, Templar knights from, like, um, well, from, like, Britannian history, I'd say, or, what would it, what the fuck would it be called, Britannian folklore? Like, knights of the round table, that sort of shit, would it be folklore? 
Yeah, anyway. Into this Galopolis well. Try and steal some good loot from here. Oh, that's right. Barrels! Yeah. 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 Yeah, I got some warmeline. That could be useful later. But, yeah, you never know. Yeah, you never fucking know until you get, like, the recipe. Sprig of narcissism. No, uh, I didn't read it properly. Hey, yeah. Climb up the well. There we go. Anyway. Yeah, I forgot to check one thing and it would be the quest catalog. Yep, two more. I'm just checking to see if there's any more um, quest lines. There is two in the Galopolis itself, it seems. Uh, yeah, two purple. That means like two quest lines in here. However, we're going to go to the inn and go to sleep because we are like out of like stamina and stuff. Uh, yeah, stay overnight. Yeah, because we did take a while to, like, try... <laughs> took a while. No, we took a couple seconds, but however... Like, that that was from the last time we played. Now all our stats have now been... Uh, there it is. Now have been healed up, so it shouldn't be that much of a problem. Anyway, into these places. Let's see the, the weapons you have on offer. A rapier. I do love rapiers, just because of like their design. But for us, like our stats would not be able to handle it. It's all bad. Then, um, yeah, these two need to get like those sorts of weapons because that would benefit us. Do do do. I don't remember rightly, but I think there is something in this shop that would be useful for us. I actually wish they would give you this sort of armor, but they don't. I would love that sort of one. Look, they sell that fucking everywhere else. Like, yeah, yeah, you can get these. You can even get a halberd and stuff like that. You can get, like, these sorts of shields, yeah. But when you go to the shop, it'll make sure you don't fucking get that. Oh, look. Yeah, they get poles. As well. I think pole arms, yeah. Um, these sorts of shields. Battle axes, yeah, all that sort of shit. But, yeah, what do you offer me, mate? Let's just check. Yeah, yeah, no, nothing there. Fucking nothing there. <laughs> a leather cape. Yeah, yeah, there's, there's that thing, yeah. Bronze armor, but just bunny ears as well. Yeah, lots of this stuff is like can be useful, but we're like flat fucking broke. Okay, I don't know why she was staring at me. That creeped me out. Yep, and uh, here it is. Quest line. Oh, good day to you. I assume you're here to sample Galopolis's world-renowned cactus cutlet. If so, I'm afraid I have bad news. The kitchen is going to close whilst I delegate my energies to improving the recipe. I'm certain such a... Uh, da, 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 da. The Golden Globes cacti who carry them extremely... Uh, could you get the, me this sort of item? Yeah. And you'll give us Trickster. I think that's very useful, but... Um, yeah, we'll just get this one and then go over to the other one, um, purple one to get the other mission. A Cactus Cutler to die for. Yep. Yeah, I'll get it for you, mate. Hey, anyway, mate. Do 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 do. Run, run to the other quest line. Shit, there's a distance. Here it is. Uh, how much longer do I have to wait? Why must the sands torture me so? Ah, oh, good day to you. You are perhaps wondering why I'm standing here, yes? The truth is, I am a painter, and I am waiting for a scene to be worthy of my, of my immortalized by hand. I've already invis- I oh, fucking can't read. The sort of image I would like to paint. A mighty, magnificent comfort unfolding in the desert. Last the sons of been blah, 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 blah. Conflict, cataclysm, chaotic, uh, such as wild side. Perhaps you can side me. And this wild side. Oh, uh, 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 uh. uh, yeah. Yeah, it's wild side, is what we need. The pet power, wild side. But I have no idea what wild side is. Single file. Nice. I know wild side's a pet power, but I have no idea to check that shit. Um. 
I know there's a way, I just can't remember. Oh, yep. Yeah. Beat monsters list. Yep, yeah, passwords. The story so far. Fun side that. Accolades earned. Okay. Okay, yeah, this is this. That's achievements. Fucking. Where do I search that shit? Attributes. Spells. Abilities. Skills. Yeah, how much it would cost to get them. It was pet powers. Wild side. Alright, so I can use it. Can use it. Right, it's just Eric, Serena, and me need to all use it. So, yeah, gigantic pain in the ass from what I can see here. <laughs> but, yeah, we need three people all to be in the zone. That's a gigantic pain in the ass to do, but it's doable. We'll just spend a lot of time just doing it. Because I can get in this. I think I can get in this. I don't think I've got that skill yet, actually. I'll check. I don't know, but I'm going to check anyway. I, no, I don't have that skill yet, because I was checking to see if I had that specific skill, because um, my character can um, get into the zone a lot easier than others, if I unlock that skill, but I haven't. Traveler Hood. What the hell is... Oh yeah, Retrification, I think is like... Yeah. Yeah, it's like every skill point that we, like, the characters have got, I can just reset them there. Yeah, I'm good. I can save that. Ah. Uh. 20 minutes ago. There you go. However, well, that time window is like my time, like, because I'm British. And, well, anyway, before we go to um, actually find those uh, cactus and do some damage, I'm going to go to the toilet. But if you've liked what you've seen so far, just hit that follow. Give me a follow. Give me a follow. Yeah. Right, I'll be back shortly. Right, I'm back. I'm back. Sorry about that. It's a bit longer than usual. I needed to uh, grab myself a drink as well. Anyway, let's continue on the story. And actually, for the the story, we need to talk to the the king. But um, <sighs> I just um. I want to do those side quests first because they can be useful later on. Yeah, I know what that um, gold cactus thing looks like. The other thing's a bit more of a hassle because, of course, we like three people need to be in the zone. Cactus, cactables. Ah. It is. And then just basic attack because Eric doesn't know any um, multi hit skills yet. This is. 
Ow. Get squelch. Heal. Buff. Get heal myself. And spells. Another Sizz. Nice, you got them both. Good little piggy. A dune berry. Yeah, this just... Oh, yeah, this is a red member of Tuckington. Or Tuckington, what the fuck, Tuckington. Alright then. I found a password, not intentionally. There you go. Thank you for giving me that. Now fuck off. So have a campsite. Makes it easier for us as well because it's just cheaper. Good horse. And they're just traveling merchant. And he sells us what we've like found in shops and stuff. Pink twine, like chimera wing. Yeah, all that stuff is useful as well. Yep. Oh, gold bracer could be useful as well. It's disturbing. Bronze shield. Yeah, all this sort of stuff is like quite useful for us to be able to purchase. But the iron cast claymore I don't need because I've already got it like maxed out. Let's just check in the, the forge, see if there's anything we can make. It could be useful for us, but I doubt it. Just check in. Yeah, no. Now back. Uh, armor. Yeah, the only thing of use could be the, the okay, the scale armor is the only thing that would be of use to me, but that is probably just because I'm wearing the armor that weakens myself. Yeah, that could be useful as well, but uh, I think it would just rework um, my elevating vest that I've got on, because that'd be useful for us like later, because it's very useful item to gain XP, but however. Very bad at the same time, like because it stats like you like you saw. Oh, that's bull boy. Oh, you motherfucker. Yeah, I don't have any good skills to try and rework that. At least it can't be poopy with that. Oh, I can, you bastard. I can't rework the item, it costs too much, didn't it? Yeah, it costs fucking six perfection spells to make. Not to rework. That's some bullshit, but alright. And then rest until the morn. Until noon. No, until the fucking noon. Until noon. Fucking. I just saw dusk, dawn, and all that shit, and I fused the D with the noon. That's stupid of me. Let's uh, just unmount from the horse and try and get up to the, one of those golden thingies. I don't know why I jumped into him. I meant to attack, but like I keep saying, I keep forgetting the button layout. It's been so long since I played the game. It is. Attack, uh, attack A. Oh, I did some pretty decent damage to everyone. And it just does a lot of damage to me. That's fun. Sizz! Anyway, spells heal myself. I think I just got a crit on the heal. I don't know, that's, that shake scared me. Wonderful. Yay! Eric leveled up. He learned the spell evac. Yeah, we need to save up all of our um, stuff because Eric needs to learn dual wield. Oh, there's a gold one. What? The uh, sleeper hit on the um, the golden globe. You want some? Abilities cutting edge, golden globe. Yeah, yeah. Ah! God, that fucker could take a hit. Abilities, yeah, no. Yeah, just basic attack on it. Um, BL's freeze. 
uh, can also paralyze them into bargain. All right. <gasps> nope, marry me. Um, let's just do that. Zap on the golden glow. Ah, you bastard. Deadly dance. Oh, no. I knew that was going to be bad. Um, uh, nothing I could do with that, so sleep ahead. I don't have any revival skills, so she's just dead until, like, we go back to that camp. Cutting edge! How the fuck have you just taken that like a champ? Not a deadly dance again! Alright, well, I think we should actually try and get rid of the Cacti Ball as well. So now we just gotta worry about the one, which makes it easier for us. Then, um, yeah, Serena, heal yourself. There's a daft dance. Oh, uh, now it's made me just weak. Now I can't stop laughing. Sleep it. There we go. There we fucking go. Anyway, spells. Uh, squelch. Let's see if I can get rid of the laughter fits. Yeah, no. Alright, perfect. Let's get rid of this fucker. Persecutor. Or Persecutor. Yes. Yay, leveled up. Um, I don't think there's anything like my character can get. Uh, yeah, the only thing I'm going to try and work for now, I think, is just the the attack power when wielding, plus 10. Because, like, the crit chance one is not going to be that useful, because it's, like, um, like, it's a chance of it. And then also, either one of them will unlock that anyway. Then Eric, yeah, like I said, going to save up for um, dual wield, because, like, he will do more damage then. Golden ore. Found a, finds a golden globe. We'll put it, basically put it in the pocket and we'll tell the chief later because we're going to try and we're going to heal ourselves and then we're going to um well actually we're going to resurrect someone first uh resurrection resurrect veronica for 80 gold Here we go. She's been resurrected. No, thank you. Then, um, just rest for the night, because we don't want to take any more risks. That's very bad. Rest till dawn. Also, I did notice that thing as well. I did notice that, um, the... The Funtime Forge leveled up, but not going to help us any, because we don't have any new recipes. Oh, that's fun. Just so many enemies. Ow. Ow. I don't know what I'm saying now. Don't mean it's getting hit. Yeah, Eric, sleep ahead. Yeah, Eric, you deal with that cacti the cacti ball, I'll deal with that rabbit. Cutting edge. Yeah. I dealt with the rabbit. Then spell Sizz on the Chimera. Then, um, just in case, him of fire. Because I'm pretty sure those chimeras, yeah, have fire. Yeah, Eric, press cutter on the cacti ball. Because look at that damage. That's so good. And the scissor again. Don't know how they're still alive. Scissor again. We're the only ones that use fire around here. Oh, that was a bitch slap if I ever saw it. Because they got it ruffled its feathers as well. Yeah, they do nothing in physical attacks. Easy peasy. Just shut up. Hardy hide. Yeah, we just need to practice on the the Yeah we yeah, we need to get the Wild West one. No. Oh. 
Yep. It's Bell. It's his on the brownies. Oh, the brownies are done. Magic. <laughs> yeah, I dodged it. Uh, yeah, just basic attack on the rabbit. Basic attack on the rabbit. Super easy. It dazzle. dazzle. Alright, one of them got dazzled. He was the one that boosted his own strength. So, yep. Uh, anyway, um, Sizz. Basic attack. Basic attack. There we go. Oh, goody. Serena loved accelerate. Then, um, what else can she get? Devil's Delight. Um, heavy attack damage, and then um, minor heat MP recovery. Yep. Yeah, so that's more useful out of the bunch. Then um, I shall use uh, yes, yeah, Serena's magic to heal everyone. Because that way we don't have to worry about um. Yeah, because now we don't have to spend on healing um, items. We can now just spend it on like files and stuff, or just find <laughs> item uh, SP up items. Look at all these enemies. Yeah, we definitely need him a fire on. Uh, let's get one of the skull riders. Ah, uh, paralyzed it. Nice. Bell, sizzle, and the chimera. Uh, spell, sizzle, uh, chimera. Or sizz, or sizzle. Sizzle's a stronger move. Yeah, uh, abilities him with fire. You know, helps out with the, the chimeras. Yeah, see what damage reduction we took. Dodge the air, nimble. Uh, sleeper hit on the other Skull Rider. Spells. Sizz on the Chimera. Got rid of two. Nice. Ow. Uh, no, I'm going to get rid of that Chimera. There you go. Spells. Heal on myself. go. Now I'm going to change settings of speed to ultra fast. Yep. Just so um, we can um, do this stuff. Yeah, what I'm doing is to try and accelerate the... Um... Well, I'm accelerating each of us, but I'm also going to... Um... Decelerate him just to get the um, the, get in the zone because it relies more on like how many times you've like had your turn rather than like how many times you've attacked. There we go. Defend. Defend. Uh, spells. I've already decelerated him. Um. Okay, put to use a. And then this one is around the pie, yep. Magic barrier. Then spells. Uh, accelerate on herself. Because it's those three that need the accelerate spell. <coughs> Fire resistance to normal defense. Um, yeah, abilities. Great sword guard. Spells, magic barrier. Then Serena, um, accelerate on myself. Accelerate. Uh, yeah, just basic attack again. Perfect. Bells, heal myself. 
bend. Bells. Heal. Uh, Veronica. Pra uh, paralyzed, can't move, defend. There we go. I'm in the zone. Defend. Spells. Um, nothing more to do, but like buff my character. Like just defensive buff. Spells. Uh, decelerate. Then, um, uh, spells. Um, zap. Defend. 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 All right. oh, that's bad. Both of those are going to go down any second for him. And same with... Yep. Uh, accelerate. Um, it spells magic barrier. Now we're talking. Oh, that's good. There we go, Eric's now in the zone. Defend. There we go! All in the zone. Wild side. Wild side. Let's do this. Look at this. They view Eric with power. Like a wolf. He's like a wild animal. Uh, settings, speed, let's put it back to normal. Battle mode. Um, no, freeform fighting. Then, um, I will have myself defend. I'll let Eric go on the assault. Because after we just boosted the fuck out of him, it would be better for him to attack. Uh, sleeper hit. Yeah, that's how much damage he does when he's when we've done the wild side. He's just boosted the fuck. Ah, oh, fizzle and bang. Those are both powerful moves, powerful spells for Veronica. Minor MP recovery, anti magic, and arcane spell that has a high chance to stop the enemies from casting spells. No, the MP recovery is more important. Here we go. Let's instead of paying out a lot of money to go rest in the inn, we're gonna rest here. Rest of the campsite. There you go, this is forge items. Just to get rid of it. Focus by one. Learn lightning bash. A softer strike with half the strength. Alright, yeah, that's good. But however, we're gonna wait to use that one. Then um Rest until dawn. So we can recover our HP and SP. Then we can go now we'll talk to those two people and get what we need. There you go. All full of horse. <coughs> hmm. and, uh, I love how we get to see the Hoto like volcano in the background. Yeah, uh, beast bone. Yeah. But now we can just hand in those two quests and get those good, the good stuff, the good good. There we go. No horses, sorry horse. Let's go talk to that chef. That chef could, um... No, no, we've gotten the item for the chef. Here we go. Oh, good day to you, sir. Does that mean you've brought me the Golden Globe? Yep, here it is. By the sounds, a Golden Globe. It's not much more charming than any other cactus. But is it not much... Yeah, I can't... For some reason, I can't fucking read today. Is it not so much more charming than any ordinary cactus? And its texture appears to be perfect. This will make the most satisfactory cutlet indeed. Perhaps I should sample a small piece of its raw... Hmm. Crunch. Oh, so rich and juicy. And so very sharp, just as a cactus should be. My cactus cutlers will, be, uh, will soon taste much better than ever. Of that I am almost certain. absolutely certain. Thousand thank you, thank you, friend. You have improved the lives of many cutlers, um, of cutlers lovers everywhere. Please allow me to give you a little something in return. 
the trickster. Bone globes are not the only rarefied forms of regular monsters. Seeking out others, no, seeking others out would provide you with valuable experience, I'm sure. Got the trickster item. Dun, dun, dun. Boom! Quest completed. And I know it's equipment, but I'm pretty sure it'd be beneficial for Eric. What does it do? Trickster. Clairvo uh, a clairvoyance card imbued with the power to evade enemies. Okay, no, it's just good for dodging. And it'd be better to give that sort of thing to Serena, as um, she is the healer of the group, and if she died, then it'd be a big problem. So, yeah, we've got those things. Let's rush over to the other side. If only we could fucking run faster. Let's go up this way, shortcut. Yeah, and that's for the horse race as well. Yay! Uh, and whilst that's pet, there must be a form of three specific people, if you know how to do that. Now get up then, show me boot. I won't sh I've already done it! I like the adventures and say a spits for. Ah, oh, okay. That is. No, I forgot about that. There has to be a specific, specific creature. So, fuck that. I'm going to go to the Sultan's Palace. You go to the Sultan's Palace, and I'm just going to talk to Sultan because, fuck that. <laughs> no, the Spitfire is a monster that we'll find later on, but it's just better to just say fuck it and do other stuff for the time being. There we go, the Royal Bedchamber. Let's just find, find whatever we can in this house, this house, this break ship. Ooh, book. Never thought I'd say the day with that one. Uh, I had a diary. Don't care, don't care. It's not something I can learn, I don't care. A pair of fishnet stockings, and then a pair of boxes. Okay then. Steal some shit. Concrete earrings. I am. Yep. I am the hero. I'm allowed to steal whatever I want. <laughs> that's justified, isn't it? Just. Like, what are you doing stealing my shit? I'm the hero. Oh, that's fine. Take whatever you want. Fucking. Like, that's just any, like, JRPG logic. Power positivity. Yeah, don't care. It's not something I can learn. Hopefully, this is. Uh, it's not quite what. Agent book here. The binding is almost completely worn, and Kiko can only make out the words "the Justidian secrets of ye flame" written on the bear. He tries to read a page or two, but something tells him he's not quite ready yet. Oh shit! I'll right, we'll come back later and learn that shit. Then fuck you. Uh, feathered cap. Uh, da 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 da. An iron broadsword. I don't need that. I already know how to build that shit. I could sell it. <laughs> Wait, is it something worth selling? Uh, iron broadsword. Now I just need to upgrade it because I think that's a lot better than my like, iron class claymore. But of course I've like sharpened the, the claymore. Actually, I don't know. Let's now run up here to talk to Sultan. Sultan! Sultan! This place, my fellow Gallopolitans, this, this place. <coughs> fellow Gallopolitans, this is no ordinary sand national. This race marks the day that Faris, my son and heir, comes of age, and as such. You, no, no, no! An event of such significance must have eloquence to match. Such functional pleasantries will not thrill my beloved subjects. Ha. <laughs> love you, Tron. And who exactly might you be? I have no time to grant an audience today. You must leave. Immediately. <laughs> There's the prince. Father! My training is complete. Mm. 
I'm loving just watching this and having a drink. I don't get to talk. That's good. <laughs> yeah. Then give me the pledge. A knight's word is his bond, his kingdom his master. He serves the weak untiringly, challenges the strong un unflinchingly, ha, and never retreats in the face of adversity. Ha. Mm, yes, very good. The knight's pledge must always be your guide, my son. <laughs> hmm? You are a man now, Faris, and tomorrow's race shall prove it. You must show your people that you are worthy of their adulation. Fear not, beloved father. I shall disappoint neither you nor they. Okay then, just, this is a bit creepy. <laughs> Don't check me out, mate. I'm not going to swing that way. What is your name, stranger? And what brings you to Galopolis? I, you see, I, I'm the fucking luminary. <laughs> no, I'm joking. No, I'm not saying that out loud. No, I've just come to find for the mysterious branch. Hmm. Surely he speaks of the rainbow. It is the only treasure of our kingdom that would warrant such a description. Ooh. I believe I can assist you, friend. Visit me in my chambers at the foot of the great staircase. I shall await you there. No, I don't. I'm not going to give you the hanky panky. All right, I don't. I, we want the rain, whatever that is that you said. We want that, but I'm not willing to do the hanky panky because <laughs> clearly that's what he's telling me to do. And I don't want. I don't want to do it, Veronica. Veronica, you're small enough to do it. You do it. You came. Thank you. Oh, at least he's nice about it. Mm. Mm. Yes, yes. Your height and physique are perfect, and you have the face of one who knows horses. I speak for shit, can you? Mm. You should be aware <laughs> that the branch you see. Oh, I fucking can't take that seriously. Just seeing the little boar. My father is unlikely to give it away freely to some <laughs> wandering stranger. Look at that little boy on the screen. However, he might be persuaded to part with it if the request came from his beloved son. I have but one small favor to ask in return. Fucking little piggy. But the palace walls have so many unwelcome ears. Ah, the noise of the circus will protect our privacy. Will you join me there? I don't want to, but the game will force me to. Agreed. I will meet you at the entrance to that ridiculous tent this evening. Do not be late, please. I'll be there hours early, mate. I've got nothing else better to fucking do. Anyway, well, as you can tell, now we just got to wait by the circus. I love that you can just see like knights training as well, but like this, look at that training technique. They're not even touching. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me just go at this angle. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it looks like it's hidden from back there, but it's covering it. Can't really see that he's just hitting the air and nothing of the actual person. Anyway, here we go. Yeah. Opening the grand doors. The back to Galopolis. Yeah. If you don't know where the circus, I wonder where the circus is. Can you find the circus? Yeah. If I can imagine that door to explore. Just. Can you find the circus? Where is it? Where? I mean, where is it? Uh, uh, only not over to daytime. Come back in the evening. All right. Yep. Now we just go. Literally, just go to um, here and rest. But ooh, there's a bookshelf. Yay! So you want to be a witch? Yay! 
I've learned how to build stuff. That's good. We have the materials for it. We can build it. Yay. But we gotta check everywhere, see if we can find it. But <laughs> joy be at the end. Yeah, we just sleep with some next to some random dude. Yeah, steal a hundred items. And congratulations, you stole a bunch of shit. <laughs> Rest for a while. Uh, until dusk. Da, da, da. Yep. There you go. Now we should be ready for the prince. No? The night falls. So, and yeah, so we got rested a little bit more. That's annoying. Actually, I'll check the fun size forge first to see what those items are and see if they could be useful for the team. Recently learned stuff. Yeah, Entrantress's gloves. It boosts. What the fuck does it do? Boosts the magical might and deftness. It allows them to steal shit. But magical might, that's the only thing useful thing it'll do, so it's better to give it to like this Veronica or something. Then. Fizzle retarded blouse. Can only be given to Veronica. And it increases defense and magical might. Chance to be prevented from cast Chance of being prevented from casting spells reduced by 30%. Nice. So that's pretty much just like if someone has a special skill that stops us, then we can just go, nah. Tricky turban, which gives the same chance of being cursed reduced by 25%. That could be useful. Wizard staff, yeah, that's useful, and then also the um, the lamp post as well. We don't have a lamp light, but we can buy it for four hundred. Yep, yeah, might as well. Got all the other stuff. Let's build this. Um, flourish, double bash, normal bash on that one, normal bash, flourish, lightning bash. You can only do that like twice more. Yep, let's do lightning bash on that. Tink. Perfect. Fucking brilliant. Yes! Not perfect, but brilliant. Oh, it was perfect. Yeah! Perfect wizard staff. Fucking proud of that one. Yes! There we go. I can now give this to Veronica. And now she can be a better wizard than she already is. I'm not saying much, though. That Oasis word. Da, 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 da. Yeah. Um. Yeah, let's not give her that. Let's just focus on the other stuff. Like, um. Yeah, let's give this. Make this for Veronica. The Oasis water is cheaper as well. We need to make Veronica a stronger witch. Flourish, double bash. Then normal bash. Normal bash. Normal bash. Normal bash. Uh, lightning bash. Lightning bash. Alright, that's perfect. If that's not perfect, that would go called bullshit. Fucking two in a row, let's go! Da, 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 da. Now, who can fucking say that one though? Just two times in a row. Just, um, gets perfect. But like, that's just so good! Rework an item then. Just we're on a roll, might as well. Got the third time, let's go! Three times in a fucking row. Double bash. Double bash. Double bash. 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 Lightning bash. Lightning bash. Now normal bash. Yeah, I'm not getting perfect on this one, but it's still good. Like it give it's gonna give us a plus one and I'm okay with that. Like, we didn't fuck that one up. 
Yeah, to plus one. Anyway, let's let's now equip some stuff to um why Eric? No. Veronica, give Veronica the wizard staff plus three. Look at those stat boosts. Gives a, a plus nine in magical mending. <laughs> there you go, that's this better. Plus twenty attack, plus nineteen magical might, and uh ten uh, a plus eight percent M magical M um yeah, MP absorption. It's, um, it's, uh, singles a single area with a small fireball when used as an item in battle. Alright. We'll equip that. Then, um... Yeah, it gets rid of the agility and charm, but boosts magical might and defense, so we have that. Then this, I didn't work on the hair thing, so it doesn't matter. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Any other item? Oh yeah, fishnet stockings and concrete earrings. Let's, um... Oh yeah, fugitive. Yeah. I like that look more than just the, the basic look. Because it adds more charm to it, in my opinion. Though I've got, like, the sword on the back, I do prefer this look a lot more. No, I'll, I'll leave it on there, unless someone tells me to change it. And like traveler's hood only I can wear, but it doesn't give doesn't boost anything else, it just increased defense. It changes the, the appearance of the wearer. Yeah, it's not that great. But anyway, um yeah, let's give um Yeah, Serena fishnet stockings and then um Veronica the concrete earrings. There we go. But we'll sleep in a little bit more. Uh rest a while until nightfall. Yeah, we just we're super energized now for fucking nightfall. Now we should be able to talk to the prince. There he is. Okay, excellent. The noise of the circus will allow us to speak without being overheard. Shall we go inside? Yep. Good. The circus is already started. We should enter without be no, 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 any delay. Now, lovely cutscene where I can just sit here, watch it, and relax while with you guys. Pet piggy! Little piggy, can't take it seriously. I love Eric's look more though. Oh. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it's time for the act you've all been waiting for. The Wandering Wonder, who amazes audiences wherever he goes! Prepare yourselves for an experience like no other! Prepare yourselves for... The Great Sylvando! Ah. Uh. Yep. That, I don't. I don't like him. It just gives gives you. He gives off that vibe of like, stay away from me. <laughs> and I wonder if anyone else has that same ideology as me. It might just be me though. Just like he, he creeps me out a bit. <laughs> no, can't deny his skills, but he's, he's, he still creeps you out. Just that little bit. Yeah. We threw those knives. Let's go kill all those people. And with a quick edit, I could easily make it really dark. <laughs> yeah, I might do that. I might do that another day. Ladies and gentlemen, please! There is no need to be afraid! The great Silvando will never endanger his adoring audience. I mean... After all, darlings, you are the ones who make this show so special! I love you all! Thank you! Thank you! Yeah, still. <laughs> it just makes me want to scream. No, no, don't touch me there. This is my no-no square. <clears throat> Quickly, we must talk while the people are distracted. And please, not a word of this to anyone. Now, as you may be aware, the Sun National is the most important event of the year here in Galopolis. 
And tomorrow, I am due to make my debut in the race to end all races. However, there is a problem. One teeny, tiny, terrible problem. What was that? I cannot ride. In fact, I have barely so much as sat in a saddle. What? Okay, then. I have so far been able to hide this uh, unfortunate fact, but if I were to take part in the race, the inconvenient truth would surely be uncovered. Okay, and then. yet I have no choice for a prince of Golopolis not to take part in the Sun National on the year of his coming of age is unthinkable! Unthinkable! <sighs> So you see, your coming here was fated. It is a sign. The forces of destiny mean me to use you as my double. Ta-da! Your double? How's that gonna work? Won't everyone notice as soon as he walks out onto the track? Yeah, you're right there, ah, the fates have provided that also. For you see, the royal family always races in full armor, lest the unthinkable occur. His face will be hidden from view. Okay, I think there was like an error there in the spelling and stuff. Oh, please, please. I beg of you. You must help me. You must enter the Sand National in my place. I think they put like there you instead of that. are the most pathetic excuse for a prince I've ever seen. If you think we're going to help you lie to your people, you've got another thing coming. Shut up, Veronica. We're getting paid for this. Is that so? Then I assume that your need of the rainbow is not so great after all. Yeah, see, shut up, Veronica, you little wow. piggy. Talk about shameless. Shut it, Veronica. We need stuff. Tell me what you will. It changes nothing. You will do as the fates wish and take my place in the race? Yes? Yes, we'll have to, you, ah, Your Highness. I knew you would see sense in the end. Thank you. I will talk to my father about the rainbow as soon as the race is over. You have my word. I took the liberty of arranging rooms for you at the inn. Rest well. I will see you in the stables, bright and early. Okay, then. You will find the stable entrance in the western part of the city. Do not be late. Now, I must be on my way. Farewell, friends. Uh, no, we're just your clients, mate. We're not your friends. Oh. See that face? That screams, no, no, don't touch me there. <laughs> right, we're accompanied inside your rooms. Then morning comes. Yeah. No, I, w I want people to know that I feel like I keep getting those no, no vibes off of Sylvando. He, he does disturb me a bit. And today is the, the day of the Sand National, so, mi so much to enjoy. The streets outside are already full of life. Pardon? You wish to find the royal dressing room? Why is it the... Why, it's the grandest room of the stables, of course. They are the west of the paddock. Enjoy the race. Well, thank you, Kaita. Run! We must run as fast as we can. To talk to the prince. Yep. Yeah, Prince Ferris? Yes, his eyes is true in the royal dressing room. You may enter, but rem remember to be respectful, please. Yeah, I shall be. Oi, wanker, where you at? <laughs> yeah, that sounds about right for Britain. Yep. Take the stars. I was beginning to worry that I might actually have to ride, try and ride a horse. Now come, the race will begin shortly. And fear not, I remember my promise. If you do as we agreed, I will ask my father about the branch. Oh, you ready? Yes. Uh, good. Now hurry, you must don the royal galopolitician uh, uh, armor. <laughs> Fear not, they will fit you perfectly, I'm sure. I, I'm not going to lie though, I do love the Galopian army. Um, Kikoro takes the, uh, the prince's armor and helm and puts them on. See, I love the armor. I just love it so much. It's as if they were made for you. No one will suspect. Uh, no one will suspect for a moment that you are not the Prince of Golopolis. Now the race is about to begin. Uh, Masori, your steed awaits you. 
yeah, my, sorry, your steed awaits you outside. That's more or less how it was supposed to be read. Um, once you are safely mounted, make your way through the paddock. The racetrack lies beyond you. Uh, meeting me afterwards in the passageway that leads to meet me afterwards in the passageway that leads to the tra tra uh, racetrack. You will give me the helm, and no one will be any of the wiser. Now go, and remember, you are the Prince of Galopolis, and the public expect great things from you. Do not make a fool of me. Oh, I shall. I love. I just love the armor. I'm not gonna lie. I love like the realistic sound of like every time you move, you can just hear the like the clinking of the armor. That's why I love the armor in the game. Yeah, I'm not going to slowly go by this. I'm ready. Let's go. Yeah, you just go love the prince's horse around here. You want the preparations are complete? Yeah, let's go. Well, I'm not gonna say anything. I'm just, I'm just gonna nod, like, mm-hmm. Of course, I can't really throw the identity out. Now, oh, come on, cutscene. Or is it minigame? Ah, oh, choppy cutscene on the on the Nintendo Switch. <coughs> Hello, Galopolitans. This is uh, no ordinary sand national. Uh, He's so nervous. Hooray! All hail Prince Varys! Oh, I love the music. Always, the music entrances me. Everyone loves me. They don't think I'm the prince, but yeah. They just ran a bunny girl in the corner. That's where my attention is. Such a fine figure of a man. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, anyone, any old person would do the same. Oh, now front and center. Yeah, front and center. I didn't care about the piggy. I was caring about bunny girl. Like any normal man would. It must be wonderful to be so popular, darling. But of course, you are used to it. Being a real live prince, huh? What the hell? What are you on about? The name's Silvano, by the way. One of the other riders had a little whoopsie, so I had to step in at the last minute. I, hate I don't you. think I'll be going easy on you just because you're royalty. Where would be the fun in that? Try to keep up, little princey. Yeah, just just go away, mate. Just, just go away. You're very charismatic. However, you still give me those vibes of just stay away from me. You still stay away from my my no no area. <laughs> oh yeah, the race. Yeah, hold the ZR to send the horse speeding ahead. Press Y to tug on the reins. Nice. Uh, turn, yeah, tight turn around those tricky corners. Yep. Yeah. Anyway, I know what I'm doing. And Mario Kart race on horse, race on horses. Yeah. Two, one, go. Dun 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 dun. Get back here, Savando. Yeah. Bye bye, bitch. This is a horse race. I'm not taking it easy on you. Pumpkin. Yay. Yay. I keep forgetting about the horse race in Galopolis. It's so much fun. It is. Yay. Hey. He's right on my ass. I don't like that. Stay away from me, Savando. Boop. Hey! Oh, just a little bit quicker. No, this is not a fucking boss battle. Get that- turn that music down. I don't have any of that shit here. Da -da. Uh, yeah, I'm just a sucker for the music as well. You can just hear it. Oh, hi, fourth place. Bye, fourth place. 
Oh, the third lap was the quickest. Fuck yeah. Oh yeah. Yes, I did it. <gasps> Pops in from out of nowhere. Oh, magnificent! I hardly dare think that you might actually win! Bitch. Now quickly, my public await. I shall take the reins from here. <laughs> yep, sure. Fear not, my friend. I have not forgotten my promise. I will discuss the rainbow with my father just as soon as my people have finished showering me with adulation. Yep. Bye bye. <laughs> yeah, it shows. It really shows, mate. Make his way onto the track. Yep. Praise the fates. Our plan was a success. Damn right it was. Thank you. You have spared me great humiliation. <laughs> I will go immediately to my father and ask about the rainbow. <gasps> okay. What are you doing here? All hail Prince Faris. Pride of the desert. Horseman extraordinaire. Darling, you are fabulous. It was enough to bring a tear even to my jaded eye. Stay away. Uh, 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 oh. Wait. <coughs> tell me you were. <gasps> Surely you didn't let your understudy take the stage for the command performance. <gasps> oh, this is too, too good. I mean, stop. Stop pretending, Sylvando. Wait, you know. Wait. But you do not understand the pressure I am under. A prince of Galopolis who could not ride a horse is a disgrace to the kingdom. I did what was necessary for the sake of my people. And now all can be forgotten. Yes? That's not happening, prince. And there was silly old Silvando thinking that knights never retreated in the face of adversity. Oh, Silvando's such a Silence. bitch. I am the prince of this kingdom, and I will not have a traveling jester lecture me on chivalry. Ooh. <gasps> a thousand pardons, your highness. <gasps> How rude. Pushing me out the way. Enter. Yes, dude. <laughs> Stand in knight armor, just in every region. The Sultan wishes to see you, Your Highness. Your magnificent display of horsemanship has pleased him greatly. Very good. I will come right away. My promise still stands. Come to the throne room in a little while. We will see what can be done about this branch of yours. So nice to see a royal with the common touch. You were wonderful out there today, darling. Maybe we'll get to share the stage again soon. I fucking hope not. <laughs> I wish there was guns in this world. I would have shot the shit out of you. Wait, no, there's still some powerful spells I know. Sis! <laughs> yeah, I did that one. Out the way. Anyway, uh, let's see. Can I? Oh, I don't have it. Oh. Yeah, let's see what else I can give myself. Now, I'm going to keep the feathered cap on me because it does boost my stats more than the turban does. Uh. Actually, not by much. But, um. Yeah, I just need to give it like a plus two if I wanted anything. Oh, look at that stat difference though. Plus two and it doesn't even like increase the stats by much. Anyway, 
Let's go and uh, yeah, head to the front room. But I do want the um, Galopian armor as well. Because I do love that armor. But I'm pretty sure as well it doesn't cover your face and I'm like, that's, that's just annoying. But I like it with the helmet on. You get what I mean? There's so many cats around here and I don't like it. Anyway, we'll just head up to the Sultan's up here. Yeah, we'll just clip through the floor and just meet the, the prince. Hello, your highness. Truly, I am humbled. All I have ever desired is to fulfill my duties as a prince and as a knight. Ah. time, prince. Father, if I may, I have promised to assist these travelers. Would you permit me to explain? Gladly, my son. It warms my heart to see you aiding those in need. Truly, you have taken the knight's pledge to heart. How is he sitting like that, is my question. That, Thank that, you, that Father. looks uncomfortable. <laughs> the truth of the matter is that my friends here have come to Galopolis in search of the rain. <laughs> Your Majesty, the beast has returned. It attacked one of our men while we were out on patrol. Hey, shit. The Slayer of the Sands is back? Why must the accursed creature always appear on this, the happiest day of the year? We will stand for this no longer. I must dispatch my finest knights and ensure that the fiend never again returns to terrorize the Celestial Sands. Can we join you, Sultan? But wait. My boy. The fates are speaking to us. Capturing the Slayer would be the perfect way to show your people what a fine knight you have become. Yeah. What? But, 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 but oh, father, <laughs> so many of our bravest men have confronted the creature and perished. <laughs> Surely, <laughs> I do not stand a chance. Yeah. <laughs> Truly, it is the most able who are the most humble. But you cannot hide your true feelings. You are trembling with excitement. <laughs> now I can see the piss stain from here. This is your moment, Faris, my boy. Capture the Slayer and take your place in history. Huh. But uh, I... I... Oh, very... Very well, father. <laughs> Yay! I shall begin my preparations right away. <laughs> yeah, I, I can tell you're going to need our help again, aren't you, knight or oh, prince? A thousand pardons. The, the rain bar will have to wait. Meet me in my chambers. What's with that droopy this eye of Eric's? Something we must discuss. This is just me. It was like, is the eye droopy? Uh, Looks a bit droopy. Uh, just breathe, Faris. Prince, you are a wuss. But we will gladly help just to, to take the glory as for, uh, just for ourselves. Uh -huh. Just immediately oh, please. Please, kisses our ass. I beg of you, the slayer of the sands will tear me limb from limb unless you aid me. Have pity on a desperate soul. <laughs> now give us money. <laughs> give us money at the top of the rainbow. Spoken like a true desert knight. Shut up, Eric. Seriously, can't you handle this on your own? <clears throat> Stop being worse. No! <coughs> no such a thing is impossible. I am no knight. I neglected my training. I allowed my vassals to fight all my battles for me. <laughs> oh, you are such a weakling. Oh, it is not my fault. Yes, it is. I am an only child. I was coddled from birth and praised for the most insignificant of achievements. 
Okay, Pampered Prince. I surprising. didn't wish to disappoint my parents or my people, so I, I, I found ways of, of seeming to fulfill their expectations without necessarily doing so. But the more I fulfilled them, the more their expectations grew, and now finally they expect the impossible. Oh, oh, oh it's so unfair. No, it's fair, don't ask. You shouldn't Don't have lied. You see? If you refuse to help me, I will I'll be laugh. sent to my doom and through no fault of my own. <laughs> Please, help. will you take pity on your old friend? No, <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, I felt like checking. I am begging you, begging. If you will not do it for me, do it for Galopolis! I want to check again, I'm pretty sure it's the same thing again. Yeah. I am begging you! Begging! If you will not do it for me, do it for Galopolis! Yeah, I thought it would be just never ending, but yeah. Oh, thank you! 10,000 thank yous! <laughs> and fear not! I will speak to my father about the rainbow as soon as the beast is captured. We must make preparations to depart immediately. I will await you at the castle gates. Yep. All right then. Oh word, Eric. Oh word. What a pathetic excuse for a prince. Goodness knows what will become of Galopolis with him in charge. Veronica, you pig, you shouldn't have said a word. Oh, we mustn't be so hard on him, Veronica. I'm sure it can't be easy growing up with everyone expecting so much of you. Yep, Serena's the, the voice of... Oh, this the consciousness of, um... It was it called? My brain's not working. Yeah, just conscience of Veronica. Veronica will just say it bluntly as it is. Which you shouldn't do, and honestly, you shouldn't do that. I know from experience it usually just ends with a red handprint on your face. You should never be blunt. Always be wary of what you say, because you could just end up fucking your life just from saying that one. Just saying the thing you wanted to say. Anyway. Enter the gates south of Galopolis. Yeah. Yay, medical herbs. Well, we're not going to go on that venture, because now we're going to go to the church and we're going to save the game. There you go. Yeah. Well, I think this is just a good place to just um, to end the video. Of the end of stream. I think that's a, this is a very good place to end it. So, here we go. Again. Here we go. So, I think this is a good place to end the stream. So, I hope you lot have enjoyed this. And if you did, please hit, the, hit that follow button. It does not mean anything to you, but it means the world to me. It lets me know I'm going to do it. Like I said, for the entire stream, I have not been able to speak. So, yeah. Like I was saying, we hit that follow. It doesn't mean anything to you. It means the world to me. It lets me know I'm doing a good job. And I will see you Friday where I'm doing a stream with most likely Sir Deadeye. So, um, yeah, see you then. Bye-bye.